Rob Cassidy, Rivals.com, here with four-star guard Jalen Reese out of Orlando. Jalen, man, how are you? How's sunny Florida? I miss it down there. I used to live there. It's doing good. I'm doing good. How's the weather out there? Much better than it is up here in the Northeast, I'm sure. Oh, well, yeah. It's hot. <laughs> Boy, I it is about 40 degrees outside of my front door, so I miss that. But let's get into it, man. Uh, how's everything going? You're getting ready for the season. What are you kind of working to develop this year to take your game to the next level? Um, I'm working to develop my finishing skills, like finishing above a basket and just being more athletic above a basket and show that I'm really athletic. Now, obviously, your dad coaches you on the AAU circuit. He coaches you at the high school circuit. What's it like having a coach for a dad and having him kind of – is it nice having him around to kind of help you all the time, or just sometimes does it get a little bit, like, repetitive? Uh, it's it's helpful. It's just knowing he pushing me every time, just wanting the best for me is good. All right, man, let's talk about the college recruiting. The last time you and I talked, we talked a little bit about Cincinnati. We talked a little bit about UCF. Are they still both the two major teams that are kind of talking to you and involved right now, or are there others in the mix? It's others in the mix, but my recruitment is 100% open. So who's it's, who's kind of in contact with you the most? Um, Cincinnati, Ohio State, Missouri, UCF, still, uh, Kansas State. All right, let's talk about some of those. What you know, Cincinnati's obviously been recruiting for a very long time. They were one of the first schools to offer you. What do you kind of know about them? And have you been up there yet? Or are you hoping to make the trip? I've been up there a couple of times. What uh, what you what you see up there? What do you kind of make of the program up there? Um, I like the program. I like Coach West. He um always keeping it honest with me, talking um with me, trying to improve my game. Now you've got a, a teammate up there. You know you know Jizzle James pretty well, right? Yes. What is he telling you? Uh, much about Cincinnati? Have you guys had a chance to talk about what it's like up there? Yeah, we talked about it. Uh, he likes it. He's doing good right now. I watch him play every time he play. I watch. That's big, bro. <laughs> All right. Well, what about Ohio State? You mentioned them. What are they telling you? And where do things kind of stand with the Buckeyes? Uh, it's doing good. Um, things are going well. Um, Bruce go there, so it's like Jizzle and Bruce. Like, I forgot you played AU with him too, even though he's from Georgia. What's Bruce yeah. tell you about what it's like there? Bruce, he likes it. He's doing good. He tell me like there's a lot of freedom, but you got to play defense. Just like everywhere, everywhere you got to play defense to get on the court. And then hometown UCF's recruiting you. They obviously just got a big commitment from that seven footer at DME Mustafa Thiem. Do you know if if you met Mustafa? Have you played against him? I think I saw you guys at the same camp once. He's kind of an interesting guy, huh? I never played. I never played against him. I, I don't know him that well. <laughs> it's a big seven footer, man, and he's an intriguing <laughs> prospect. What's UCF telling you right now about kind of what they're doing there? They just kind of, kind of want me to stay home. Is that something that's appealing to you, staying around Orlando, or would you rather kind of spread your wings and get somewhere else? Uh, it doesn't matter to me, just wherever I had an opportunity to play at. And the last one you mentioned was Kansas State. Obviously, Jerome Tang has done some pretty impressive things there in just one year. Where's where are things kind of staying with the Wildcats, and what are they telling you? They're telling me that, like, obviously they have good guards. They always have good guards. Uh, coming from last year, he did – the guard was really – he was really good. And this it's year Marcus they have – Marcus Noel, right? Yeah. This year All they right. have – well, so, like, they just kind of telling me, like, that's a guard school. They develop guards and all that. Have you talked to them about possibly going on an unofficial visit or an official visit up there to Manhattan? Uh, I'm probably going to go on an unofficial visit. I don't know when. All right, man. Well, I appreciate you joining me, and thank you for your time, Jevin. I'm sure I'll see you pretty soon. I always do. Yes, thank you for having me.